Hey everybody, I am Elle Duncan. This is The Kitchen Sink. On today's show, we're going to spend some time with a bunch of hippies in Austin, Texas. Gospel hippies, that is. And we introduce you to Austin, our... Texas is a music lover's dream. In addition to Austin City Limits and the South by Southwest Festival, there seems to be, seriously, a music venue on like every single corner. And yes, there's plenty of gospel there too. In fact, Gospel Brunch is huge in Austin, so we decided to check out one particular brunch. This one is at Maria's Taco Express, and the featured artists are a little, um, quirky. We'll go with that. Welcome to Hippie Church, y'all. Ain't gonna let nobody turn me around. We call it Hippie Church. It attracts, <laughs> obviously, called. a bunch of uh, South Austin Colorful hippies. people. One of our local entrepreneurs, Maria's Taco, had a spot open that she needed some voices to fill and asked if we would sing gospel on Sunday mornings. And that was the beginning of Hippie Church. Heavenly Father, hear me as I pray. Got something on my head, it won't go away. It's evolved through quite a few different people because our musicians, we are always evolving in different groups, different bands, different styles from more traditional gospel to now more of a just a positive gospel music or message of love. Yeah, our yeah. love. Love That's, and joy. Love and joy. Oh, peace, yeah. harmony. Going up to the spirit in the sky. We have a new diet. We call it the Gospel Project Diet. You come to two gigs a month and you lose 40 pounds because you're dancing the whole time. Guarantee results. That's what they call it. They're us. Our yeah. audience is us. We are the audience. I mean, if we weren't up on stage playing the music, we'd be out there canoodling and doing the body choir thing and everything because it's just a lot of fun. They call me the cowboy poet. I've been singing gospel a long time. I'm a welder by trade. I have a, my own fabrication company, Scrap Art by PJ. I work as a radio DJ and a traffic announcer. I'm a computer, uh, computer uh, support technician by day. I'm a full-time musician, singer-songwriter. When I'm not doing gospel music, I, I play in the Americana and country genre. My work in the high-tech world, I manage a group of interactive web producers. That's what I pretend to do as a job, but I really enjoy singing with this group the most. <laughs> we are spirits in the material world, spirits in the material world, spirits. I work for the Lower Colorado River Authority on my day job as a water surface manager. I uh, hail from Denver, Colorado, but uh, moved here to Great Austin in 1980, and uh, lucky enough to be playing music with some great people here in town. I think that, you know, the music scene here is really just an abundant of amazing talent. So what that does for everybody or anybody that oh, is performing is it really raises the bar. For, for us, I mean, we're kind of a mishmash band of people, you know, that are in all different walks of life. I mean, some of us are pros, some of us aren't, but we still strive to be as great as we can be and, and improve and, and uh, garner respect from our peers, you know. <laughs> It's like playing for family. You're, it's like everybody's family. Everybody appreciates it, and they support us 100%. It seems like every time we play there, with the, we get lots of ovations, uh, lots of kudos. People are really there to hear the music, and that's, that's what really drives us. The one word that Jesus really taught us was love, and we just wish that there could be more of it, because that's that's what we're about, and that's what we like to sing about. That's what we want to be known about. It's just that one word, love, uh -huh. that we were taught. Going up to the spirit in the sky. That's where I'm going to go when I die. When I die and the day you to rest, you're going to go to the place that's the best. The same day we shot their performance at Maria's, the Rock and Gospel Project recorded their performance live for a new CD. It's called, obviously, Live at Maria's. You should check it out. It's great stuff. When we come back, our Listen Up artist for June is right here in the building. That's 2103.